Hey, what's going on YouTube? Easy Tech 2 through one here, and we're gonna be checking out the Revolution case from Poetic. Shout out to Poetic for sending me one for the Galaxy Note 5. So what exactly is so great about this case? Well, it's rugged very rugged. I think it's safe to say that this is the most rugged case that I've ever used and in terms of protecting my phone, this one trumps OtterBox and UAG cases. Mm, maybe. To be fair, this case does add a pretty decent amount of bulk and it makes the phone a lot bigger and heavier. It's a two-part case with a main shell made of polycarbonate and TPU materials, and the initial plastic casing has a built-in screen protector with water-resistant capability. Along with that, you'll also find a very handy kickstand on the back that's either made out of cheap metal or high-quality plastic. Nonetheless, it's very sturdy and it holds up very well, and I don't see it snapping off too easily. Now, taking a look around the main shell, you'll see that you've got port covers used to keep dust and junk out of the ports and you've got a loop on the upper left hand corner of the case. I'm not too big of a fan of the way it makes the case look but that's just me. I guess if you wanted to hang your phone somewhere you have that option with this case. The back has a pretty neat looking design. Poetic did a great job with the choice of materials to give the case a really good grip. The back also has two tiny screws on all four corners and yes those are real screws. Really the whole design was centered around protection from extreme shock and impact. This case was meant to take a beating. So what's it like? using the case. Well, it's different. Like I said before, this case is quite large and it does add bulk. And normally, I'm not a fan of big bulky cases, but to be completely honest, I actually liked using this case on a daily basis. It's extremely solid and durable, and I didn't have to worry about dropping my phone or accidentally scratching the screen. Not to mention that kickstand is pretty useful as well for catching up on some YouTube videos while working on my computer, for example. Now, of course, there are some downsides to this case. The S Pen can be slightly difficult to access, and because of the thicker screen protector, you lose a very tiny amount of sensitivity, but it's nothing major. The case can be a bit of a pain to remove and then reapply. And of course, the case is most definitely not meant for the minimalist or someone who likes thin, sleek devices. This will not fit skinny jeans, and it just might weigh down your gym shorts. But that's not what this case was meant for. It was meant to protect your phone from every single drop, scratch, ding, punch, kick, throw, step on, flush. Okay, don't actually try flushing it, but you get my point. This is one beast of a case and if you're looking for a case that can handle pretty much anything you throw at it or anything you throw it at then this is the case to get the design on the back looks pretty sweet the ports have dust covers and it has a built-in screen protector a sturdy kickstand and overall an extremely solid build with zero and i mean zero give it's literally the turtle shell of cases if you want one of your own i've got a link in the description you can pick one up for just twenty dollars which is a fantastic price it's totally worth the money and i definitely recommend it thanks for watching guys.